you ever have something just kind of smack you over the head? I've been making videos for this Pie for Safety event for March 14th for, I don't know, week, maybe longer. And it occurred to me today, of all days, that we're in the home stretch. We've got, you know, we're getting down to less than a week. And I've got Mr. Ray Wisenhunt, who is going to be one of our speakers. And Ray is one of my board members for Safety Positive Foundation, along with Andy Prisco and Christopher Tisdale, who's a blind individual. And all week or longer, we've been talking about building bridges of communication between the sighted and the blind world. And today, it hits me like a Mack truck, just BAM! You know, the four of us have been building a bridge of communication between the blind and the sighted community for a, over a year now. That's what we've been doing. You know, Ray has been a beautiful example of, of it. And he's gonna be one of our, he's, he's our last speaker on this Pie for Safety event. Ray, Ray has macular degeneration that runs in his family. He is a, he's a big advocate of personal, personal safety. He's very well known for saying, if I'm going to have to live in this house, I'm going to help build it. So he's big on the choices thing. He's very well spoken when it comes to talking about anything when it comes to personal safety. I mean, of course, I mean, if you, if you know Andy Prisco, he's also very well spoken and, and I I'm so honored that that these gentlemen have chosen to to speak on this Pie for Safety event with us. But ultimately, like I said, today of all days, I realize that, you know, the the Pie for Safety event, I've been saying, you know, that's the day that we are we're building the bridge. No. Safety Positive Foundation, we have been building this bridge of communication for over a year now. And, and we are not done. We, th that is, that is the, one of the things that we want to do because if we can work on this building the bridge of communication between these two worlds, this will ultimately help in the personal safety of the blind community. Because as you've heard me say, there's some miscommunication going on between these two, two communities. So, um, I, I just had to share that. Um, and uh, so, we really hope that you can join us on this Pie for Safety event. Because Ray Wisenhunt has a lot to share with you all. On, on this topic of building the bridges of communication between these, these two worlds. Without, without Ray sort of guiding me in, in this, I don't, I don't know if we'd have a safety positive foundation. It probably would have taken me longer to, to get to this point to where I'd be like, oh yeah, this, this should be a thing. Um, and, you know, he helped to build the bridge between Andy Prisco and myself. So, um, you really, um, it's going to be an honor to hear Ray speak. It's going to be an honor to hear Andy Prisco and Tony Blar and so many others speak on our Pie for Safety event. If you can't make the event, I understand. We, it will be recorded. You can also donate in supporting us. You can donate $14. You can donate $20. Fifty dollars, hundred dollars, whatever, whatever you can donate, please donate. We have a large goal, very large goal of fourteen thousand dollars. This goal is going to help us to bring in new programs like the Spear Spear Care program with Tony Blar. That is going to be huge. We we need great hands-on training programs like the Spear program to be able to offer this choice. To the, to the blind community. We need the top-notch, high-quality services like this to, to be able to offer. So, if you can attend, awesome. 
donate. That's what we're really looking for here. So building bridges of communication. I will be attaching both the Google form and the donate link because we are officially less than one week away, people. It's gonna be a lot of fun, a lot of high energy, and uh, of course, great speakers like Ray and Andy and Tony and so many more. So um, as always, keep it safety positive until then, and we'll talk to you shortly.